What's up guys, it's your boy Ro, we're back again today for another video, oh, 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 oh. So today we're gonna be doing inside the house, okay? We're gonna start off with the closet, inside the master room, um, and just get, try and get the master room finished up today. Um, I guess let me go ahead and show you guys what it's looking like right now. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and take the shelving down, um, and as you can tell, I went ahead and started patching the walls. I'm going to sand those down after I get the shelving down, because after the shelving comes down, I can possibly start painting. Alright guys, I know you guys are probably wondering why the heck did I take the door off. So, um, whoever painted this the first time um, did a lot of overpaint, like a lot of overpainting. Um, and I just wanted to make sure when I do paint it, it's just one flush paint, you know what I'm saying? Like it's not going to have a patch going around the door and there's like probably paint all on the little door thing, the little hinge. I didn't want to do all that, I just want to make sure it's clean. So I went ahead and took the light um, cover off, took the doors off from the closet and the door to the actual closet. Isn't that crazy? It's a closet inside a closet. <laughs> For the most part, all the shelvings are down. Um, the doors are off. And I think what I'm going to do next is I'm going to go ahead and sand the patches that I put in there. And for some reason, I think I need to patch something else I saw right here. Yeah, right here. So there's a little mark here. I got to patch that. And there's another one here. Right here, you guys probably can't see it on the camera, but yeah, I gotta patch those two. I didn't see them the night when I was patching, but yeah, so I'm gonna get those patched up and um, should be ready to paint. All right, guys, I went down, went ahead and took the hooks off. Um, that way it's nice and clean. Uh, I've got my patch here. This is what I'm using. So I'm gonna use that to fill in these two holes I have here. Um, and then look around and see if I have any more around the room. I think that's it. Yeah. That is it. All right guys, I'm gonna be using this sandpaper here. Um, I think it's 400. Yeah. I'm just gonna get it and I'm gonna come to the wall and I'm just gonna Damn guys, look at my head. I already wiped myself off though, but it was way worse than this, like I had the um, look. All right, guys. So I was using my um, I was using the sand, the 400 grit sand sanding paper with my hands only and that was way too what do you call it like it was easy but I have so much more to do so I'm just gonna get my machine out um, and go at it with the machine because I have a lot to do the closets ready to be painted so it's just a matter of knocking out some more patches Some stuff down here um, and just naturally around the room I want to see if I can get my sand paper 
like places like this. Let me show you guys. So you see this stuff here? Yeah, all of that. I'm gonna see if I can knock all that out. I think there's some more over here as well, like unevenness in the wall and just a lot of stupidity. I'm gonna knock that out and let you guys see. Alright guys, at this moment, everything is sanded down nicely. Um, I, it's an interior perspective. Um, so I mean, the camera's not gonna see it like perfectly like how I see it. Um, I mean, I could, I could, um, what do you call it? I could, I could change the settings in the camera, but it's not that big of a deal. I feel like the quality right now is pretty nice. Um, Everything's buffed out, sanded out, the wall, a little unperfect um, spot that I seen on the wall itself. I got that out real nicely with the machine. So I think now um, I'm gonna get the vacuum, vacuum this up and wipe down everything because I don't want to uh, paint over dust. So I got my wet cloth here. Um, I'm gonna make sure I wipe down all the, everything I'm painting, like the corners. Make sure I wipe it down before I paint it and yeah.
I'm gonna be honest with you, man. This paint right here, <laughs> and I think I still have to come over and put another coat, even though like one coat's done. I think I have to come and do another coat because this paint is just how this paint really is. Like I should have got a one coat paint, um, but when I bought it, I thought it was automatically gonna be a one coat. Everything is done pretty much. And I'm like, damn, like that, it took a while, man. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So for the most part, that's gonna be it for day, what's this, day five? All right, guys, that's gonna be it for day five. Um, thank you guys for watching, I appreciate it. Um, I thought I was gonna get most of the room knocked out, but that is the only thing I can do today because that paint only allows me to do so much because it's, I gotta get at least two coats. So I had to make sure everything was like double coated pretty much as I was working and it was just a pain in the ass. I don't think I wanna do that for the rest of the room. I think I'm gonna go get like an, um, a semi-gloss um, and a latex-based paint, I think. I don't know, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go to Lowe's tomorrow and figure out exactly what I wanna get for the, exactly um, the walls in the house because this paint right here is not it, is not it chief. I gotta find, so I think I'm gonna use this for all the closets um, in the room, like the closets and the closets in the guest room and such throughout the house. Um, that way I can finish that, but for the actual walls in the house, I'm gonna get a better paint, because that paint, that that double coating that I gotta do, uh-uh, that ain't it, Chief, that takes it too much time, so. Thank you guys for watching again, I appreciate you guys. Don't forget to hit that like button, comment, subscribe, and like the video. Appreciate you guys, man, your boy Ro is out.